Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And if you're new to the channel, thank you so much for watching today and don't forget to subscribe. So for today's video, I am going to be recording and doing like a demonstration of all of the at-home workouts from my Plant Powered program. I have several ladies following the Plant Powered Challenge and um, a handful of them will be doing the at-home workout portion. So mostly this is for them, but also for anybody else who downloaded the program and need something to refer back to to make sure that you're doing the exercises and the workouts correctly. So I will be showing like just a beginner version of the exercise, just using body weight. I also have like ankle weights, resistance bands, dumbbells, things that you can include into the at-home workouts to make it a little bit more challenging, add some more resistance, and work on building some more muscle and toning the body. So I won't be doing every single workout all the way through. I'm just going to go through one set of each exercise so that you guys know what the exercise is supposed to look like, how you're supposed to do it. And again, like I said, and like I've said in all my workout videos, have something to refer back to. So I think that's all I need to say right now. I probably will just put like music over the entire thing and just do a voiceover for any exercises or workouts that need a little bit more explanation. But um, if you just watch what I do and do that, then you'll be good. So let's get started with at-home workout day one. Hey guys, so I decided to start with the warm ups before the at home workouts because I realized that some of those things you guys may not know what they are. So, right here, I'm starting with neck tilts, 10 reps for each warm up. That's gonna be how you do the entire thing. So, that's what this is right here to the left, to the right, ear to shoulder. And then we have neck rotation, look over your shoulder, left to right. And I will let this play out and then pick up here in a second. Next up, I am doing torso rotations. Make sure that you hold the rotation when you are facing back just to get a nice stretch in. Next, we have chest expansions. I show you guys the front view and then here in a second I will show you the side view so you know which range of motion to stay in. Warm up number five is side arm raises. This is basically just like making a snow angel but standing up. A nice little air angel for you. Get you warmed up, feeling good. And then next we have arm rotations. You're going to do 10 forward rotations and then 10 reverse rotations. Then we move into the lower body warmups. Um, the seventh warmup is hip rotations. Basically you position your leg into a 90 degree angle, pick it up in front of you, bring it out to the side, touch the ground, and then do that in reverse. These are super good for opening up the hips, getting the glutes formed up and everything. I really, really like these. Next, we're gonna be doing alternating single leg hops in place, um, just as you see here. And then we move on to the last warm up, which is basically the same thing, except you're going further out to the left and to the right. So now that we are all warmed up, let's get into the workouts. <laughs>
challenging but um, over the next few weeks if you continue to do these and you find that like your body's adapting and you need more of a challenge then I can't breathe I just ended up with burpees so kind of having a hard time if you want to make it more challenging you can add ankle weights resistance bands dumbbells kettlebells another great thing to add are these little ab sliders. You can use them for upper body workouts. You can put your toes on them and use them for mountain climbers and it like activates your abs and stuff. So these are another great thing to have, but you really don't need more than a couple of dumbbells and a resistance band. And it doesn't have to be this kind of quality. You can get those like $10 for a pack ones on Amazon. So again, I hope you guys enjoyed that. I hope that it was helpful. Don't forget to like and comment and subscribe. And if you are interested in the Plant Powered Program, the link for the website to download the program for free is in the description box. Thank you again for watching and click that subscribe button and the thumbs up button. I would really appreciate it. I'll see you guys in the next video.